Hi guys, TSM here. Welcome back. Um, so I finally managed to get some uh, swallowtails built and uh, just in time to get into the last bit of the uh, mastery round, obviously, of the uh, the TLC that gives us all the uh, the tech for these swallowtails. So um, I'm going to have this running in the background and we'll talk about the ships in the foreground, basically, what I've decided to finish on. I know I did a sort of a initial video on uh, the plan, but um, now I've seen obviously the additional special, which we didn't know was coming. Um, I'm just going to go for a quick review of uh, what I've decided to sell on, basically. So here's the first one. This is the obviously the countermeasure ship there with the MDS-3s fitted on it. Um, it's basically pretty straightforward. The circuitry, etc., is the same. Yes, I've added obviously a countermeasure special as well. I've gone there for three missile armors, as I thought I probably would do, based off of what we saw in the VXP target and the way I saw the damage coming back in. Everything else it seems quite normal as my previous build, um, obviously apart from the new special in the top right-hand corner. Um, everything's pretty generic so lower damage yes 31 uh, K but obviously quite a high load um, punch of really doesn't matter so much but obviously quite a lot of uh, UAV damage there 994 percent so I'm not sure if that's going to help a lot but don't forget these are at U3 uh, evade I'm keeping up at 71 I'm driving these you may want to change your armor obviously if to to two of each you know two corrosive and two missile if you're gonna try and auto but I'm gonna drive my ships um, like I say in the background here is a bit of footage of obviously four swallowtails in action they're all at U, um, U3 uh, just to show you basically look some of the missile deflection you can slow this down if you wish to um, but I just thought you saw some of the incoming missiles and obviously the fact that I can see some ships here's the second one um, this is obviously the one that's full power now you'll notice obviously I've gone for three missile armors but Please notice that obviously one of them is from the previous tier and that's a weight restriction issue which I discussed about in the previous video and I know Derby did the same thing as well. So we're both I think going for a very similar on the on the um, on the armor selections okay then but um, this one here obviously uh, we have got a slightly different special there i.e. there's no counter special so we're getting some more uh, more um, penetrative damage as well in the top uh, top left hand corner. So hopefully that um, this will come out uh, 83,000 damage, obviously, which is considerably greater um, than obviously the, the, the ship. Um, but then again, I'm going to have three like this, okay? So there'll be three of these that will be full damage, and then two of them with the MDS 3s on. So I'm hoping that that's. Um, I don't really mind whether it's a flagship or not. It's down to the individuals, I think. I might change it to the MDS 3s on the flagship. But basically, I'm going to have the biggest penetrative survival anyone anyway, on the flagship and ship five, because obviously, with missile and accuracy based. They tend to target either ship one or ship five. Okay, so we'll we'll take a look at that and we'll, and we'll see what comes. Uh, basically, then I'm just going to finish off this target and just obviously zoom in a little bit to um, give you some idea of basically what uh, what the ship's quite good at. I like the fact that obviously I'm, I'm really chuffed we're back onto UAVs again. Um, they are good fun, I must admit. And uh, you'll notice in a minute that I managed to chain. You know, um, here we go. Look, so. Incoming there was not too bad at all. I managed to deflect, and it's like four MD, uh, MDS-3s on there, so I managed to get rid of nearly all the incoming um, penetrative uh, missiles. Uh, and this is the sort of thing that I like. Is obviously, you know, there you go. It's a good example of knocking down the incoming there and taking out all four of those uh, you know, troublesome targets and outranging these now as well. So if you are, um, if you've got one or two of these, then obviously you can use this in the TLC. Just a quick reminder then, so there we go, that's the that's the MDS-3 version. It could be the flagship plus one, ship five, if, if my advice, uh, if you're going to go for it. Or um, you can do two normal ones now. So I'm doing two normal ones now, but I'll change uh, once I get the flagship built. It was nice that kicks give us some extra tokens. Uh, I think that was because there was a bit of a mess up in bounty. So um, And that's obviously the full power one. So uh, that's about it. I hope that helps. Um, like I say, it's a quick review. It's nothing special. Um, Okay, that's it. Thanks very much. Take care. TSM out.